Hey there everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com, and here it is, the Galaxy S3 on Verizon. And yes, it is now running Jelly Bean, finally. <laughs> so, uh, this is a virgin phone, I actually took it back from CyanogenMod and, you know, went back to stock just for this update. So first thing, let's dive into about phone and see exactly what we're dealing with. There it is, model number, Android 4.1.1, there's the build number, so VRB LK3 for those of you counting at home and go through a couple of the new things. Now, it's still TouchWiz, right? That hasn't changed. Samsung didn't get rid of TouchWiz. They didn't drastically change it. You don't have a whole bunch of the features that you do like on the Note 2, but you do have Google Now, and this is a big thing. I'm not actually signed in here, so you're not gonna see any cards or anything, but that's how you get to it. You hold down on the uh, menu button, long press. So another big change is actually in the camera, and they have added, well, I'll show you in a second. So, all right, blah, blah, blah. Fresh phone, gotta go through all this, and take a picture. And now we can do cool things to the picture, including, hey, filters, because everybody's doing filters now. Awesome. Great. Um, another one that Verizon points out, of course, is the notification bar and the new stuff in here. So if you uh, get a missed call, you can call people back directly, which is cool, I guess. Nice. Call that number if you want. That's our office number. Whatever. <laughs> and, um, another thing is that this phone is now ISIS compatible. ISIS is the Google Wallet competitor uh, that you know Verizon is behind, which is, let's face it, the reason why you don't see uh, Google Wallet on Verizon phones. So NFC is turned off by default, by the way. You'll need to turn it on. Uh, ISIS is not really live yet. I mean, it's live in Austin, Texas and Salt Lake City, but that's it. So still have a little ways to go there. But this is Jelly Bean on the Galaxy S3, the most popular phone probably in America right now. And it's about time we have it. So now we just begin the wait for Android 4.2, right? <laughs> there you go. Quick look and we'll see y'all later. Hey everybody, it's Phil from Android Central. And if you want to help out the site and look good, go get the best damn Android t-shirt anywhere from shopandroid.com. Thank you.